So she had liver liver cancer, yeah. stage four. She was in Reno during the state tournament. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And the treatments, all yeah. the kids had the signs. And right. She just died back on October 16. Okay. Yeah, he's a little more in touch with that because his boy goes to eat. So. Okay. Yeah, I remember that now. So yeah, we're gonna be like I said, we're gonna put the decals on. We're gonna have bigger decals that we're gonna be selling and donating all the profits to coaches versus cancer. Cool. The tax thing is gonna be coaches versus cancer. Yesterday, two hours ago. 
slide down a little bit. Okay. Oh, here's, uh, let's go, let's go. There we go. Well, we don't want that there. We can't see. It's hard to see. Oh, jeez. What do you got going here? Holy cow, that's good. Are we on? Uh, so they can hear everything. All right, Stacy, they can hear everything. <laughs> oh, it's good to be back, huh? Yeah, welcome to Heritage on a Sunday night. <laughs> Well, we got four Francis here, Stacy, and you know we just beat them the other night, and it would sure be nice to actually take them again here tonight on our home ice. Well, that's for sure. We're going to have Arnold in the net tonight. We'll see what he can do. I know last Sunday night when we were here, he had a great night, so hopefully that can carry over again tonight. Yeah, that sure would be good. You know, they're giving Zurich the night off uh, after playing two games in a row here, one of them being a shutout, and then last night up in Dryden, he had quite a bit of work. Um, you know, that's too bad that... Uh, we couldn't have given him a better showing in front of him, but you know, but that's okay. It's nice to see him getting some action and playing real good, and actually as a team playing better in front of him. You know, we got that new addition in Mashad here tonight, so it'll be interesting to see how he uh, adds to the offense here, along with Franks and some of the others. Yeah, let's get with the starting lineups for the Lakers: uh, Henry Gutierrez, Dallas Allaire, Connor Hady, John Carlson. Brett Mc, McCann, and uh, in the goal, number 78, Tanner Hamilton. And for the Clydesdales tonight in defense, Chris Palm and Troy Olson. Forwards, Reed Armstrong, Miles Beeson, John Blasco, and as I said before, number 31, Matt Arnold in the net. Coming in with a 3-7 and seven record. That'll be, it'll be interesting to see tonight, too. This uh, Fort Francis team actually has a, uh, you know, kind of similar to what we do with uh, Swarski. They have a, a midget age player coming up as an alternate player, and, and Brandon Sinclair. So it'll be kind of interesting to see how he sizes up here with these bigger kids. Well, they're giving us the starting lineups here. Hopefully we'll have the national anthem. Yep, so let's step aside right now, and we'll get the national anthem and old Canada out of the way, and we'll be set to go. First All right, actually, yeah, they're doing our, our uh, starting lines, but let's, let's, uh, let's go ahead and take a minute here.
Well, we're ready for some hockey action, Stace. Yeah, hopefully we get some tonight. We'll see what happens. Probably should, uh, as we're waiting for the refs to drop the puck here, just kind of give everybody a reminder about uh, what's going to be happening down here at the Heritage next Sunday night. You know, they're going to be having that tribute and fundraiser for the Rachel Sandell, uh, the young lady there at uh, Duluth East High School that passed away here about a month ago from uh, cancer. So just want to let everybody know that all the proceeds for that are going to be going right to uh, right to the foundation there uh, for coaches for cancer. So we'd like to get as many people down here at the rink as we can, you know, because, you know, it's all going to go to a good cause. Yep, and if you want, just text COACH to 20222 for a $5 donation. And we're underway on a Sunday night. Clydesdales control the puck, setting things up in the Lakers zone, flipped out. And we're going to get an icy call right away. Well. Going to bring things all the way know, back down into the Clydesdale zone, it looks like, for a face-off. Right circle. Beeson again on the face-off for the Clydesdales. Puck controlled by the Lakers. Hung up on the near board. Sent across. Intercepted. At the blue line. Sent back out down into the Clydesdale zone. Thrown around back behind the net. Clydesdale's trying to get it out of there. Puck hung up on the far side wall. Now brought out to the center. There's a shot. Knocked away by Arnold. Chris Palm been there battling with Beeson. Puck comes out behind the net. Far left corner. Clydesdale zone. Lakers have it. Pass out front. Had number 96 there, but Puck went past, and we're getting a whistle. All right. It's going to be outside the zone. Looks like it was just knocked down with a high stick. So a line change for both teams. Yep. Looks like we're going to get yep. a face off in the neutral zone. Got the number one line out there now. Lakers controlling the puck at center ice. Send it all the way down around the net into the Clydesdale zone. Smith knocks it back behind the net. Getting it to Mershon. Mershon bringing it up hard on the near board. Crosses the blue line. Might take a shot. Feeds it up front. Oh, oh had Morissette wide open net. Morissette couldn't handle the pass. Lakers come up with it. Puck still down. Nope. Back out to neutral ice. Tomasoni chasing after it. Gets it down. Sends it over to Morset. Morset. Shockley. And penalty, it looks oh, like. Yeah. Going to get an interference on the play there. I mean, you know, in that situation, see, what you can't do is you can't, you can't hit a guy after the puck has gone. And that's clearly what happened there. The puck was, you know, Shockley played that puck and moved it out to center ice, and he came in and just laid. It was a, would it normally be a clean hit. But because the puck was clearly gone, that's going to be an interference every but, time. So that's going to put Colton Spicer in a penalty box for the Lakers. So the Clydesdale's on a power play right off the bat here. There's a pass up to Stetton, right side of the net, down in the Lakers zone. Lakers come up with it, two on two. They just clear it all the way down. Arnold comes up from behind the net. Risky play. Laker comes up with it. But they recover. Puck stays down in the Clydesdale zone. Lakers still have it. There's a shot and a goal. Short-handed goal. Oh, wow. Wow, only 26 seconds into the power play, and the Lakers come up with a goal. Yeah, can you believe that? Actually, the funny thing about that particular play, I mean, that's what started that off right away. I know you and I had talked about it off the air last week and, and uh, about how this is going to be a mirror image of the first uh, weekend of the ser season when we had to play two games on the road far away, come back for that third game. And you can see coming into the zone, even though we're on a power play, they were skating real slow, very complacent and lazy on that. They just gave the puck right to him in front of that. Yep. Well, here's the face off after the goal. Shockley got it, throws it down into the Lakers' end. Still a minute 20 left on the power play for the Clydesdales. Let's see if we can get that one back. And there it goes again. Olsen just taking his time, missed the puck, goes all the way down into the zone when it should have stayed in the Lakers zone. Mershon to Morset. Morset to Olsen. Passes it back to Mershon. 
Olsen takes a long shot, and Hamilton smothers it. Yeah, like I was saying just a minute ago, I mean, yeah, it's been a long road trip, but guys, they gotta they gotta wake up, you know, especially early on here. This Fort Francis team, they're a hard four checking team. Oh, yeah. We can't let them get the jump on us right away. Here's the face off controlled by the Clydesdales. Mershon and looks like he just <laughs> threw it out of play. <laughs> Like there was field goal arches yeah, up there. That <laughs> Would have been a little bit wide to the left, though. All right, face off left circle down in the Lakers zone. Shockley facing off against Marin. Here's Mershon. Long shot by Olsen. Knocked away. Olsen gets his back. Sends it to Mershon. Middle. Drives a little, tries to send it up front, knocked away by a Laker, puck back out to neutral ice, being chased down by Murron. 25 seconds left in the power play. Here comes Shockley bringing it up. Loses his footing. Boy, Bruce thought he was going to get a trip there. He, yeah. even looked at, he looked at the referee, and, and his arm never went up. Puck's down in the... Lakers zone. Brian Palm takes a shot from the blue line. Wide left. And well, Lakers are back to full strength. Lakers throw it out. Center ice. Here comes. Well, here's the first shift for Mashad. Let's see what he can do. Allaire gets it for the Lakers. Neutral ice intercepted. Mashad had it for a second. Sends it down, intercepted by Palm, sent over to Tierce, knocked away. There's a shot wide right. Arnold lost his footing for a second, but luckily the shot was off the mark. Here comes Gutierrez, knocked away by Tierce. Trant has the puck. And I think the net's off the pegs. Yep. Yep, that one's going to stay in the zone there. That's about the second or third time that one has, uh, has come off. Boy, Stacy, their legs just sure look flat. Yeah, it doesn't look good to start, I'll tell you that much. Here's a face-off right circle down in the Clydesdale zone. Here comes Williams, throws it all the way down. Hamilton has to knock it away. They got him skating up again tonight, Stace. Yep. Here comes the Lakers, crossing center ice, number 24, that's Colton Spencer, left circle, takes it around, feeds it out front, nice defense there. Oh. Puck controlled by the Lakers, far board, Williams comes up with it, oh. and we're going to get a slashing or something here, I think. Looks like he's going to take them both. Probably give them both a roughing penalty. Yeah, our guys have to keep their heads tonight, too, especially if they know they're going to be extremely tired. You know, you don't want to let it get to you and just start taking crazy penalties. Here's Beeson against Larson. Face off center ice. Lakers control the puck. Drop back into their zone. Now send it all the way down to the Clydesdale zone for an icing. Oh, yeah, okay. Yep. Actually, he's uh, he's given uh, our guy a hold on Chris Palm and a cross check on, uh, on for Francis. All right, face off down in the left circle, Lakers zone. Puck controlled by the Lakers, trying to send it around to the far boards. Intercepted by Tomasoni. Tomasoni to Morse. Edward Morse did take the shot. Knocked away by Hamilton. Puck stays down in the Lakers zone, though. You can definitely see the inexperience out of this young defenseman, this midget. He's playing very timid for Fort Francis. Here comes number 27, Smith. Knocked away by Mershon. Puck down in the Clydesdale zone here. Tomasoni comes out of it with no. Well, we got whistle. more extracurricular activities. We got Wensley. Got Wensley Beeson. 
uh, and Smith. Boy, we're going to fill this box up here pretty quick, Stace. <laughs> Up oh, Mershon and Smith. <laughs> I think this ref didn't know didn't know what to expect tonight. He's he's talking with these guys like, oh, it's going to be a long night. Yeah. You know, but these Canadian teams, they do like to intimidate, do like to come at you hard early on, and we just can't let it get to us, you know. Just yeah. walk walk away, let them go in the box, get the power plays. Yeah, the fans like to see fights, but fights don't win games. No. But they are going to be offsetting penalties, so we're still going to be skating five on five. Looks like we may be losing some players for the night here already. Oh, that should curtail any future fighting, I would think, if they're going to be that quick to, on the trigger. Yep, we're losing Mershon and we're losing Smith. Wow. And they're losing Wensley and Smith on their side. Wow, five-minute fighting game misconduct for each of them. <laughs> He's definitely laying the hammer down, Stace. He's saying, I'm not going to mess around. Wow. Wow. Well, it's going to be five-on-five five hockey, though. Um, but... It's going to be five-on-five five hockey, and uh, I, I think we're going to see a little bit of less uh, fighting here tonight. Now we're going to get a face-off at center ice. It's going to be Shockley going against number 71, Jordan Larson, for the Lakers. Yeah, looks like we still got some confusion. So Shockley against Burris is what the faceoff's going to be. Puck controlled by the Lakers. Crossing center ice. Thrown down to the Clydesdale zone. Ryan Palm comes up with it. Sends it to Thomasoni. Intercepted by Sinclair. And... Hand pass. Okay. It's going to bring it out of the zone. So Shockley against Burris again. Well, Morissette laid a, a nice little friendly hint on their on their rookie player there, Brennan Sinclair. Puck down in the Lakers zone. Thomas only chasing after it. Puck controlled by the Lakers, number 14. That's Connor Hady bringing it down. Nice pass to 20, Jordan Sinclair. Left side, feeds it off front. Knocked away by Ryan Palm. Here comes Shockley. He's got Thomasoni to his left, Morset to his right, passes it right to Morset. 
Morissette tries to get it back to the center with Shockley. Puck gets taken away by the Lakers. There's a long shot from just inside the blue line. Knocked away by Arnold. Puck controlled by the Clydesdales coming down. Crossing center ice. Tomasoni near boards. Makes a nice move. But intercepted by the Lakers. Now controlled by Williams. Sends it to Blasgow. Puck goes down into the Lakers zone behind the net. Glasgow and Beeson chasing after it, but Lakers come out of it, crossing the red line. Here comes Spicer, right circle, feeds it out front. Intercepted by Williams, but then taken right back by number 21, Cody Kennedy. Beeson trying to get it to Glasgow. Just seems very slow tonight. Yeah, I, I mean... Here, like comes, it. here comes Armstrong. He, Blaskow throws it out front. Ricocheted off of Hamilton. Williams keeps it down into the Lakers zone. Puck came right out front to Blaskow. That would have been a nice shot, but he missed the puck. The puck goes all the way down to the Clydesdale zone. Well, yeah, it's weird because I know just skating here, Stacy, sometimes the ice gets soft and the puck moves slow, but, but this seems way more than just that. Mashad has it, loses it, Lakers throw it back down in the Clydesdale zone, puck rolling behind the net, brought back out near boards, Clydesdale send it around to Tears, now to Mashad, nice pass over to 28, Spencer Franks, and nice save again by Hamilton. Well, we're getting some shots on goal so far, five shots on goal by the Clydesdales versus three to the Lakers. Yeah, but Stacey, we got to get something inside of 60 feet. Yeah, they're all coming from outside the circles. Here's Trant on the faceoff, left circle. Ryan Palm throws one up there, knocked away by Hamilton. Puck behind the net. Mashad to Trant. Puck just laying there, right circle. Mashad comes up with it. He's got Trant out front, trying to get a pass. Gets it in there, but just knocked away. And Lakers able to clear it all the way down to the other That'll end. That'll be icing. Well, halfway, basically halfway through the first period, I mean, we're controlling the shots, but just nothing like we've seen in the past. Real nice passing plays or anything, just almost just throwing it at the net and hope yeah. for a rebound. Yeah. Here's Shockley in the face off. Again, the puck gets by Olsen. That's twice so far in that blue line. There's more set. Over to Shockley. Crossing the blue line. Shockley throws it up there. Over the net. Tomasoni comes up with it on the far board. Now the Lakers come out of it. Crossing the red line. Number 10 coming right up the middle. Olsen and Palm, nice defense, slowing things up. Puck down in the Clydesdale zone. Right circle, back out to the blue line. Riffle over to 14, that's Haiti. Shockley up to Tomasoni. Tomasoni to Morset. Morset's going to throw it down into the zone for a line change. Haiti comes up with it, sends it all the way up, crosses the blue line. Williams is going to chase it down behind the net, and again that net comes off. <laughs> yeah, I tell you. Every time somebody gets near that net down there, it seems like it's getting bumped off. Well, we're playing the bang on the drum team from the Packers. Let's hope we can get some offense going like the Packers did. <laughs> Could score half that many points, we'd be in business here. Here's Tier speeding it up. To Armstrong. Armstrong throws it behind, but no follow-up. Long shot. Oh, that's going to roll in! <laughs> Boy, it went right underneath the goalie's right arm. I think he thought he had it, and it snuck through in a slow roller across the line. Yeah, that was kind of a Ooh. weird shot. I mean... It's a long shot by Tears to even things up at one. Yeah, I mean, one of those shots, you know, normally would seem harmless coming from the point, but he went to stick it away, and when he did, it actually 
ricocheted up under his arm and kind of hit his armpit, came down, dribbled behind him, and creeped into the net. I mean, you don't like seeing those kind of shots because that's what we've been getting all night, but hey, every once in a while, if it goes in, that's okay too. That's what you got to hit the brakes when you can get them. Clydesdale's come up with it. There's a nice check by Carlson, but Trant comes away with the puck down in the Lakers zone, tries throwing it out front, had blast. Yeah, and you know, it, it seems like that kind of lit a fire in our guys, too, because this line that just came out here, boy, they're actually really moving their feet, so. Spencer Franks chasing after it, loses the puck, comes out to Tears, Tears. Over to Mashad. Mashad throws it back down into Lakers zone behind the net. Trant chasing after it. But no help for him. Here comes more set. More big hit. Lakers controlling the puck. Puck at center ice. Feeds it over to number 96, McCann. McCann throws it down into the Clydesdale zone behind the net. Lakers come up with it. Thomasoni bringing it up the near boards. There's Olsen trying to help. But Ryan Palm comes all the way over from the left side. Flips it back to Shockley. Shockley. Up to Palm. Ooh, couldn't quite get it there. No. Nope. Lakers control the puck, trying to set things up in their own zone. Bring things up to center ice. And they just throw it up, and Arnold's going to cover it up. Well, we've seen them pick up their step here a little bit since they scored that goal. Now if they can just kind of build off it and create a snowball here. And That'd certainly be nice. Bring it a face off. Beeson against Gutierrez. Left circle. Puck stays down in the Clydesdale zone. Behind the net. Cannon just sitting out in front of the net and waiting for the puck, but they can't get it. Blast nice. nice pass up to Arnold. Near side, crossing the blue line, takes a shot, knocked away. Gloves it by Hamilton. Nice save. Puck's back out to center ice, but here comes Olsen on the aggressive. Knocked away by number 14, Hattie. Puck goes along the far side. Blaskow picks it up, sends it to Beeson. Right circle. Armstrong has it, takes a shot at the net, knocked away by Hamilton once again. Armstrong comes up with it, puck staying down in the Lakers zone. Nice little cycle. Tears is looking for the pass. Chris Palm takes one from the blue line, just knocked wide left. Puck down in the near, near corner. Beeson has it, tries sending it out front, knocked away by a Laker. Pass up to Morin, Morin. Tries to get it underneath the legs of Tears, but knocked away. Good defense by Palm. There's a long shot from the blue line. Wide right. Puck comes back out to center ice, controlled by the Lakers. Line change for the Clydesdales. Puck sent all the way behind the net. Tears is going to come up with it. Stetton has it. Knocked off the puck by Morin. And the Lakers will come up with it once again. That definitely looks like they picked up the pace a little bit. <laughs> they sure did for those first 10 minutes. Puck stays down in the Clydesdale zone, controlled by the Lakers. Nobody out front. Nice pass. Now they got a couple guys out front. Number 15, that's uh, Mike Jordan hanging out front. But it picked off by Shockley. Shockley up to Swarski. Swarski loses it. And picked off by a Laker. Puck stays down in the Lakers zone. Shockley intercepts it. Palm has it. Flips it all the way down to the net. And saved by Hamilton. Does that count as a shot? Believe it or not, it does. Jeez. Comes the Lakers. Spicer coming up hard to right side. Goes behind the net. Olsen on the defense. Passes it back to number 10. He tries throwing one. No angle on that shot. Palm comes up with it, and puck goes out of play. Yeah, you know, you mentioned earlier that, you know, about how the pace is picked up also. It's amazing, you know, where 
you get down a goal or you know just something in the game happens and it just seems as if they just step it up a, a bit and you you wonder why can't a coach or something just motivate them on the bench and say let's pick it up pick it up never happens and then something on the ice happens and it's just like plugging them into an electric socket yeah. and away they go yep here's the face off down in the Clydesdale zone puck controlled by the Lakers Spicer right circle oh so I didn't even miss that but uh, they're on a power play how did we miss that yeah I didn't see any hand go up or anything yeah Chris Palm so Lakers got, got a hook. power play, minute 46 Palm left in the power play, 519 left in the first period. Score remains tied 1-1. I thought it was funny because they cycled that puck way too nice down in our zone. I said, wait a second, everybody, <laughs> we must be short a guy. Puck back out the center ice, controlled by the Lakers. Got Spencer Franks, Morissette, Olsen, and Williams out there for the Clydesdales. Again, about a minute ten left on this power play for the Lakers. There's a shot, high wide left. Puck's still controlled by the Lakers. And we're getting a whistle. What's that for? Outside the zone. Yeah, it's a, as I say, he almost signaled like a hand pass, but I don't know how that could have been. What's he... <laughs> their coaches want to know what they're calling too. Yeah, I didn't really see much action there. Yeah. So we're going to get a face off neutral zone. Beeson. <clears throat> He's going against Larson. Puck controlled by the Lakers. Crossing the blue line. The only thing that could have been probably was a uh, man on the crease. All right. Lakers have it down in the Clydesdale zone trying to set something up. They got a layer out front of the net. Yeah, see how he's crowding Arnold there? Yeah. Why doesn't our guy just go in front of him? What's so hard about that? They've got all these new rules with interference where you can't do that anymore. There's a oh. shot in a goal. Boy, I don't see, know how that even got in there. There was so uh, much congestion. Well, I'm going to tell you, that, that is why USA Hockey's wrecking this game the way they, they are is because – in the in the old days, even ten years ago, that guy standing in front of our net would have been flattened. He, you'd never get you'd never get away with that front creating the traffic that he did in front of Arnold, where the guy could walk right in. But I mean, now you can't touch that guy standing in front of the net. So why couldn't you go in front of him? Well, because then you're going to be the one creating the screen for our guy. So you you don't want you don't want that guy standing directly. You got to keep yourself between the goalie and him. But in the old days, you'd, you'd flatten that guy. In this case, he couldn't do anything to him. Let him stand right there in front of Arnold, walk right in, and shot five hole in the net. All right, well, just like that, Lakers go back up two to one. Four minutes left in the first period. Clydesdale's back to full strength. Yeah, in the old days, that never happened. He, that guy had been down for the count. There's the puck. There's another shot. Oh, Arnold didn't even Boy, see I it. It hit off his left foot. Yeah. It just came out. He didn't even see it. It's a good thing he went down on that one because his pad was on the ice. Otherwise, that would have been in on that too. Oh, well, that was a quick whistle too. Yeah, what was the whistle for? Thought just he had it? Thought he had it. All right, face off, Clydesdale zone, left circle. Clydesdale's got to make something happen here again. Quick shot by 15. Jordan knocked away by Arnold. Here comes Shockley out of there with it. He's got Tomasoni out front. If he nice gets move. To him. Nice move by Shockley. Keeps it down in the Lakers zone. Tomasoni chasing after it. Now the Lakers come up with it. Coming through the neutral zone. And thrown down into the Clydesdales behind the net. Williams is going to chase it down. Gets it up to Tomasoni. Near side. Tomasoni passed all the way over to the far side to Olsen. Olsen throws it down into the Lakers zone. Puck going behind the net. And comes back out to neutral ice. Puck 
Puck stays down in the Lakers zone near boards. Trant has it. Oh! Rashad takes a shot off the pipe and out of play. Well, you can hear that one. Yeah, you heard the clink. <laughs> All right. You know, it's funny. Other than that power play, we've pretty well controlled the play. Yeah, it's been okay. So we're going to get a face off out of neutral ice. Trant, puck controlled by Clydesdale. Mashad hits it behind the net down in the Lakers zone. Trant chasing after it. The Lakers come up with it. Nice check by Mashad. A layer for the Lakers has it down in the Clydesdale zone near boards. Oh, nice little move. Yep, Trot comes up with it. Feeds it to Frank. Frank over to Mashad. Mashad takes a shot. Nobody there for the rebound. There's another shot. Wide left. Knocked away by Hamilton. Nice job on the defense. Tears keeping it in there. <laughs> can't get it to go. Another save by Hamilton. Boy, a couple nice shots there. I thought one might fall. Mashad making things happen out there for the first night skating. Yeah, you know, last week, watching Frank's last week before he got ejected for fighting, he was, you know, creating a lot of quality opportunities. And then again tonight here, that uh, Trot, Franks, and Mashad line, that they've had some good opportunities oh, here yeah. tonight. So keep them together. I think we're going to see good things. Here's a face off. Beeson going against uh, Tataputek. Glasgow throwing it down. Armstrong chasing after it. He's got Beeson on the left side. Puck down in there. Sitting oh. in the front. Should have let Beeson take that shot. He had a better angle on it. Puck comes out. Kept down in the zone by Palm. Beeson comes up with it. Right circle. Throws it back to the right boards. Armstrong chasing after it. There's Palm again. Stay, Got to stay aggressive. We're down here right on the doorstep. Here's Armstrong. Throws it. Nice shot. Ricocheted. Knocked away by Hamilton. And the Lakers come up with it. 14, that's Hattie. But Hattie Hamilton didn't points. see that shot. It just hit him. Yep. Pardon me, Colton Spicer bringing it up for the Lakers. By the blue line, stolen. Here's a breakaway. Oh, look at Blasco. Holy cow, slow mo. Unhooked the train. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I almost uh, thought he was skating towards our net. He was a little <laughs> slow there. You would have thought he's at the workout facility and had 20 pound weights on each of his skates. He just could not get those feet going. <laughs> I mean, it's just like, and you could see. I mean, it was the little engine that could. I mean, he's. I don't know if he's just tired or what, but he could not get those legs going. I don't know. Puck stays down the Lakers end. Shockley on the faceoff. Puck controlled by the Lakers. Here they come, crossing the red line. Tearson Williams on the defense, knocked away by Shockley. There's a little breakaway. More set. Over to Tomasoni, near boards, Morissette coming up the gut. Puck taken away by a Laker. Nice defense. Boy, they had the oh. number there. Shockley intercepted. Open net. They get a shot to go. There you Woo, go. That's a nice shot by Shockley. Nice steal. He's going one-on-one -on -one against the goal, and he throws it in. We're all knotted up at two with 33 seconds left in the first period. You know, once again, I mean, they made a bad errant pass coming out of the zone. Shockley picked it off and showed tremendous patience. I mean, what he did is he made a move to the middle like he was going to try and just take the shot, drew the goalie down, went to the outside. Goalie couldn't get up. He had basically an empty net, just buried it. That was beautiful. Yeah, it was good he didn't take the shot right away. He knew he had time. Yep. So, like I said, 30 seconds left in the first period. Face off control by the Lakers. And here's a one-on-two. Knocked away. Good defense there. That could have been a... Quick goal given back. Clydesdale's come out with it. Here comes Tears, far boards. Bringing it all the way down. Back out to neutral ice. Williams has it, throws it down on the zone. Hamilton just snares it with his glove. Five seconds left in the period. Puck stays down in the Lakers zone. And that's well, going to do it. Lots of entertainment. A lot of entertainment. You know, not a bad way going into the into the first intermission. The only thing better would be up a goal. But uh, all things considered, you know, out shooting them 18-6 to six in the first period. And actually, you know, they started out with a lot of long shots. But in the end, they started picking their feet up and getting some quality chances. That's a good deal. So after one, Clydesdale's two, Lakers two. We'll be back after this.
Tell us when you're ready. <laughs> Here we go. Well, we're back, Stace, for second period. I mean, we looked pretty good that first period as the period went on. And, uh, we, you know, I was just telling you, we just got word on the on the two Smiths. The good part, you know, at least for our part, is that they're not going to give him that third man in penalty, which means he's not going to face a suspension. Just going to give him a major for roughing, and then that game is conduct for tonight. So that's, that's a positive thing. That's definitely a good break. Yeah. Yeah, it just seems like lately, <coughs> at least all of our home games that we've been doing, every time for the last three weeks we've been getting guys suspended for two games. Yep. Here's the face off to start the second period. Gutierrez against Shockley. Puck goes down into the Clydesdale zone behind the net. Palm chasing it down, sends it back out to center ice, controlled by the Lakers. Allaire sends it over to Gutierrez. Gutierrez takes a shot outside the right circle. Sent out to Tomasoni, crossing the blue line, taking up himself, throws one at the net, and Hamilton corrals it. Boy, oh boy. <clears throat> Maybe, it, you know, we were talking about, you know, the, the guy skating slow and everything in the first period. Maybe the ice is slower than we think. I mean, the, the ice has been done here for a good five to seven minutes, and I didn't think he'd laid that much water down, but, boy, it is not setting up at all. You can see standing water all over the place. Yeah. Here's a face-off down in the left circle, down in the Laker zone. Puck behind the net, near boards. Trot chasing after it. Comes out there with it. Here comes the Lakers, send it all the way down into the Clydesdale zone. Behind the net, puck comes up the near board. Carlson gets it for the Lakers at neutral ice, sends it back down into the Clydesdale zone. Ryan Palm trying to kick it. Can't get rid of it, puck stays down there, thrown out front. Knocked away by, uh, look like, yeah, Arnold Machad. got a piece of it. Yeah, Machad was there too to help out. Here's Trot sending it over to Williams. Olsen sends it down into the Lakers zone for a line change. Long pass for the Lakers all the way down. Boy, Williams is a little slow getting off the bench there. It almost cost us. Uh, can't tell who that was, but he was breaking up the middle pretty good. And, and that pass was just a little bit ahead of him, and so... We lucked out there on the icing. So we're going to get a face off. Beeson going against the Catapuck. Puck stays down in the Lakers zone. Beeson comes up with Ooh. it, sends it out to Blasco. He had him right up the horn, missed him. Blasco couldn't get the stick on it. Puck goes all the way down to the other end for an icing. Boy, another slow start to this period, Stace. I mean, if we can pick up where we left off that first period, we'd be really rocking and rolling, but uh, we're just coming out of the gate slow. Yeah, seems like it. Another face-off left circle down in the Lakers zone. Puck high in the air. Blasco comes up with it. Here's Tears from the blue line. Takes the shot. Knocked away by number 21, Kennedy. Another shot from the left circle by Williams. Puck comes down. Spicer. Just throws it down into the zone. Puck down in the Clydesdale zone. Controlled by number 19 for the Lakers. Right circle. Trying to make a move. Intercepted by Williams. Puck comes out to the middle. And Armstrong knocks it out. Stays down. In the zone, but now cleared. Here comes Blasco crossing the blue line near boards. Knocked down by 11. That's Brandon Sinclair for the Lakers. And the Lakers come up with it. Taken away once again by the Clydesdales. They're going to make a line change. Puck coming up from the Lakers zone. Pass neutral ice all the way down behind the net. On the Clydesdale zone. There's a check by number 15, Mike Jordan. Trant comes up with it to Stetton. Stetton back to Trant. Tries to make a pass to Swarski, not looking. Wow. (coughs) 
Well, I mean, we started off the period here, four shots on goal. I mean, he's had to make a couple tough saves, but we've had nobody there for the rebounds on any of them. There's a face-off down in the Clydesdale zone. It's going to be, uh, looks like, Trant against Gutierrez. Puck controlled by the Lakers at the blue line. Knocked away by Trant. Puck sent back around the net. Near board. Long pass to Stett, knocked away by number 14, Connor Haiti. That could have been a big play for the Clydesdales. Lakers throwing it back down in the Clydesdale zone. Nice pass, here comes Trant right up the middle. That play looked like Stetton should have been going on the left side. I don't know why he was cutting behind him. Here comes Swarski with the puck up to Tr Trant, loses the puck. Lakers come up with it. Swarski's been getting quite a bit more ice now. Looks now like we got a penalty here. More set out. Offsides, offsides. Lakers bringing it up. Oh, loses the puck to Tomasoni. One on two. Takes oh! the shot high right. <clears throat> nice backhand yeah, shot, but it, it just tries to throw it up there. Puck down in the Lakers zone. Now it's going to come out. Neutral ice. Olsen has it. Sends it up to Tomasoni. He's got Tomasoni and more set. Puck stolen by number 44. John Carlson for the Lakers. There's a shot from outside to right. Had Arnold's head flying all over the place on that one. Yeah, almost like a pinball machine. <laughs> Boy, that's the fifth icing this period. And we're not even, we're just five minutes into the period. Oh, my math's right, that's one icing every one minute. <laughs> that's crazy. Here's Carlson shot from the blue line, wide left, couple ricochets on its way up to the net. Puck controlled by the Lakers. Now taken away. There's a pass to Tomasoni back to Shockley. Oh, just Knocked about away. got him. Chris Palm comes up with it, crossing the blue line. He's got more set out front. Passes it over to Tomasoni, but unfortunately he's going to the bench. Kicked off by Armstrong, sent up front. He had more set there. Knocked away. Oh, oh, that's a stick right to the face of Armstrong. You can hear that hit. Yeah, what a oh, slap. Man, I he's mean, staying he... out there, too. <laughs> that had to hurt. And the ref didn't even see it. Boy. Oh, my gosh. You can hear it from up here. <laughs> I, I mean, wow. <laughs> Armstrong to Shockley. Shockley crossing the blue line. Back to Armstrong. Armstrong to Palm. Back to Oh, the what a play. Oh, boy. Nice <laughs> pass in there. I think Palm's man, he didn't take the shot. <laughs> I mean, it was a beautiful pass, but I think he could have got one in there. Uh, he, he had the goalie down. and he, But, you know, you got you got to give him credit, though. I mean, that was a tic-tac-toe play. And, and you're never going to be faulted with, you know, making a play like that for a higher percentage shot and, I mean, like you said, he, he banged the glass like, man, maybe he should have took oh, the shot, but he a, made a great play. Yeah, that was some nice pass in there. Back to action. Nice pass by Williams all the way up to Beeson. Just couldn't get it in. Again, knocked away by Hamilton. Lakers come out with it. Crossing the red line, three on two. Here's 71 from the right circle. Takes a shot. Oh, wow. Right over Arnold's right shoulder, catches the top left side of the net and drops in. Puts the Lakers up three to two with 1340 left in the second period. What do you see there, Bob? Well, that's a tough play. I mean, he came into the zone, made a nice little drop pass, and it, it, it caught Williams flat-footed there. Flat, he, was, he was looking back at the lead skater and, and didn't pick up the guy that grabbed the drop pass quick enough. Unfortunately, once he did, he created, you know, he's a big kid. He, he created... He was definitely a better door than a window for Arnold on that. I bet Ar the way it looked, Arnold didn't even see it until it was in the net. Well, here's Mashad after the faceoff. He loses it. Lakers come up with it. 
Puck out at neutral ice, crossing the blue line. That's Moran, throws it wide right, but gloved by uh, Arnold. Yeah, the bummer thing about goals like that, too, after we have two or three quality plays down at our end, really nice scoring opportunities, and then they come down, they get a goal like that. And yeah. you just, here's the, I mean, you want to talk about taking a wind out of your sails. That's and a that, tough one. And it wasn't a close shot. I mean, he was in the middle of the right circle. Yeah, I just think he, did, he didn't see it, I think, because well, of Williams in front of him. Well, we're back at it. There's a shot by McCann. Wide right. And oh. we're going to get a penalty here. We're Who are going to call gonna this one on Williams? Call. Yep. No, maybe not. Actually, it's going to be on four Francis, which is quite the surprise. Number 13. 13, yep. that's Dallas yeah, Allaire, Allaire, one of the starters. Yeah. Going to get a tripping call. Well, let's uh, let's make him pay with this. Let's get one right back. Yep, two-minute power play for the Clydesdales. Puck down in the zone, setting things up. Mashad, center at the blue line. Throws it back to Shockley, left circle. Behind the net to Moore set. Back out to Mashad. Mashad, there's a shot. Knocked away and cleared by the Lakers. All the way down. Armstrong comes. Gives it to Mashad. Mashad bringing it up. Sends it over to Olsen. Crossing the blue line. Sends it behind the net. Down in the Lakers zone. Puck comes out to Mashad. Pass intercepted by Olsen. Nobody behind the net. Fires it off the glass. Yeah. Nice Puck. shot there. Puck comes back out to center ice. Here's Tomasoni. Tomasoni sends it down far board. Comes up with it after the Lakers get a stick on it. Olsen comes out with it. Left circle. It's got Mashad coming out the middle. Couldn't get oh. it to him. Boy, it seems like we're moving slow motion here for some reason. Here's Shockley, 19. Gets it to Mashad. Nice pass. Oh, more nice shot. shot. Boy, yeah, Thomas Sony right up front. Lots of action up front. Can't get it. Lakers clear it. Boy, right on the doorstep, oh. too. And uh, Morissette took that shot, but just couldn't get it in. There's going to be another penalty. Here just you go. give it to Here him. Just Shockley. give it to him. This, those the are the steps. plays. Just let him touch it. Yeah. Because you want to, you wanna, if we're going to go up, to, you know, with a two-man advantage, you get them that puck right away and get the stoppage of play and, All right, we got 24, that Colton Spicer. All right, 23 seconds of two-man advantage and a nice face-off in the zone. Well, it'd be nice to get things tied up here. 11.33 left in the second period. Clydesdale's coming out with Mashad, Tomasoni, Shockley. Boy, Morissette, he's, uh, he's loading it up. And Olsen. Four forwards, one defenseman. Here's a shot by Olsen, and gloves. Right in his guts. By Hamilton. Oh, man. Nice hard shot, though. But you know what? The defense parted like the Red Sea on that. <laughs> I mean, Hamilton, uh, he had plenty of uh, vision on that shot. Here's Larson against Shockley, right circle down in the Lakers zone, trying to clear it. Mashad loses the puck, but he keeps it down in Held the zone. In his Olsen own, comes yeah. up with it. Over to Shockley, left circle. Shot. Oh, nice save the by goal. Hamilton. Tomasoni right there, but just misses it. Broken stick and puck cleared by the Lakers all the way down and uh, back to five on four right now. Boy, I don't think Hamilton saw that last shot. He fired it right off oh, his shoulder. Oh, that was a nice long pass oh. up to Tomasoni. If he could have got his stick on it, that would have been a good one. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, we got an icing on the play. Yeah, back to that last play. I tell you, it was a nice little tic-tac-toe play there and to Tomasoni, and he got a quality shot off. He was going top shelf, and it just hit Hamilton in the shoulder. So face off down in the Clydesdale zone. Once again, Lakers shorthanded still for a minute 22. Larson has it up front, stolen by Shockley, given to Morset. Back to Shockley, Morset near board. Right circle, throws it up, rebound, can't get it. Mashad throws it up there, wide right, knocked away. And the Lakers clear all the way down. Boy, Shockley, I thought he was going to give the give and go to Morissette there. I thought they had it working. Just couldn't get his stick on it. There's a long pass up to Stetton at the blue line. And then Hamilton gave us a nice juicy rebound too, and there was nobody home. 
Armstrong's got it. Far board in the corner. Tears comes up with it. Stetton has it. Keeps it down in the Lakers zone. Pass to Armstrong. Armstrong back to Tears. Tears sends it around behind the net. You got Trant coming on the far side. Chris Palmer's here to keep it down in the zone. He's at the right side blue line. Trant looping around to the middle. Left circle. Drops it back to Tears. Tears to Chris Palm. Palm to Stetton. Stetton back to Palm. Palm takes a shot. Knocked away by 19 Morin. Lakers trying to clear it and they get it out of the zone. And it looks like they're going to kill off this power play. Five seconds left. Puck all the way down behind the net. And full strength for the Lakers. Here comes Alaire looping around down in the Clydesdale zone. Nice defense by Trant. He comes up with it. Trant. Boy, Trant's looking pretty good tonight. He's moving his feet. Yeah. Nice job by Stetton getting a stick on it. Trant comes up with it again. Center ice crossing the blue line. Far boards. Little Malachi crunch there. He had one on both sides that one. That's right. And he still hangs on to it. Tries to throw one backhanded towards the net. Blaskow's there. Yeah, he said enough's enough. He's going to the bench now. Here's Ryan Palm. Blue line right side. Throws one up there. No rebound. Nice job by Hamilton and grabbing it. You know, that's the one thing about Hamilton tonight. If I've noticed that if if he sees the puck, he's really, really good at holding on to it. You know, where we've gotten those rebounds is on shots when he hasn't seen it, but we haven't had anybody home to, to plug in a rebound. So here's Beeson facing off against Kata Paytuck. Right circle, puck controlled by the Lakers. Coming up through the neutral zone. Olsen chasing it down for the Clydesdales. 44, it's John Carlson all over him. They come out with it. Two on one. Here's Olsen. Blaskow up the horn, feeds Oh! Him. That's not a high stick. Again, he hit him in the head with a stick. Yeah. Right in front what of the ref. What is the ref looking at? Here's Olsen from the blue line. Knocked away by Hamilton out of play. Wow. Right in front of him. Man. And then on top of it, Bla you know, I think because of it, Blasco couldn't get you know get a quality tip off the shot. I mean, shoot, you get hit in the face with a stick like that. It's that might slow you down just a tad. <laughs> Here's Shockley against Larson. Left circle. Down in the Lakers zone, Tomasoni picking it up near boards. Tries to feed it back to Morset. Lakers come up with it. Long pass. Tears has it back out at neutral ice. Now Larson for the Lakers comes up with it. Crossing the blue line into the Clydesdale zone. Shockley all over him. Nobody wants the puck. Williams comes up with it. Feeds it to Morset. Far boards. Crossing the blue line. Can't believe they didn't call off sides there, but Shockley has it. Throws it to the net. Rebound comes back out to the Lakers and puck's going to go all the way down to the Clydesdale zone. This group's not quite as sensitive about the offsides as some of the other uh, ref groups I've seen. That would have easily been offsides. There's a slow roller out in front of the net. Tears did a nice job yeah, there's, of getting there, away. I will say there has been a lot of chances tonight where I, you and I both look at it and think, that wasn't that offsides and that offsides? Yeah. And they're letting them play. Williams gets hammered. But the puck gets up to Tomasoni, takes a shot, knocked away before the puck gets to the net. Tears coming out front, looking for a pass, can't get it. Williams just comes skating in out of nowhere. And now we got a three on one. This could be trouble. Arnold knocks it away. <laughs> net off the post. And, you know, he was looking behind him on that, too. He... He committed, and he was down early, and that puck hit him, and he was looking to the back of the net, and thank goodness their player ran into the far side of the post because that puck was just laying there. Yeah. Wow. We're going to get a face-off. Gutierrez going against Trant. Left circle. Clydesdale zone. Puck's hanging around down there. Allaire comes up with it for the Lakers. Left circle. Trying to get it out to Carlson. Can't do it. Nice pass by Mashad. Out to Franks. Franks, nice check into the board. 
And 96 comes up with it. McCannon. Spencer Franks working hard down there, keeping the puck down in the Lakers zone. Yeah, this line's been fun to watch all night. Carlson comes up with it for the Lakers, crossing the red line, throws it all the way down into the Clydesdale zone. Olsen is there on the defense. They have a nice balance between aggressiveness and skill. There's 14, Hattie. Whoa, that was a quick shot. <laughs> Arnold just nabs it. Getting back to what you were talking about earlier. <laughs> Isn't hockey a great sport? Oh, Hattie. Only sport that you got out there where you can hit somebody with a stick in the face. And, and as long <laughs> as the ref's not looking, you get away with it. Haiti takes another shot at the net. Hits a couple guys on the way up, but Arnold still had to knock it away. Clydesdale's coming out with it. Ryan Palm, far board. Now Beeson has it. Over to Tears. Tears to Beeson. Puck goes down into the Lakers zone for a second, then sent all the way back down into the Clydesdale zone. Near board. Behind the net, number 24, Spicer comes up with for the Lakers. There's a shot. Re Arnold's got to knock it out farther than that if he's going to do it. Armstrong has it. Yeah. Throws it down into the zone. Yeah, you got to be careful. He can put that on right in front of the net. Armstrong comes up with it down to the Lakers behind the net. He's got Blasco out front if he can get it to him. Slow roller covered up by Hamilton. You know, that's Boy. another skater tonight that actually has looked really, really good is Armstrong. He's yeah. been real strong on his skates tonight and, and physical, you know, fighting through checks, coming out with the puck. So face-off looks like uh, Shockley going against Larson. Puck controlled by the Clydesdales, but stolen by Larson. There's a long pass up ahead, crossing the blue line. Knocked away, Olsen to Morset. Morset up to Tomasoni, far boards, left circle, takes a shot. Rebound, nobody there. Back to Shockley, can't get his stick on it. Puck controlled by the Clydesdales, trying to set things up here. Sent behind the net to Tomasoni. Shockley helping out. Puck on the corner, far boards. Four minutes left in the second period. Lakers up three to two. And the Lakers come up with it. Olsen keeps it down in the zone for a second. Jordan takes it, crossing a blue. Oh my gosh, they didn't call offsides on that? Wow. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I know. He's Puck about two steps. Clydesdale zone. Near board. Olsen in there fighting for it, trying to kick it out. More set. Shockley. Big check. Tomasoni just throwing it down in the zone just so he can get a line change here. We got to get the linesman at EKG. We should give a zap on her chest, find out if they're awake. Man, <laughs> Look man. At these uh, he's looking right at it. And he does the onside signal. Nice check by Tierce. Trot, long pass up ahead to oh, Mashad going to beat him. After it. Oh, gonna get an icing call. Wow, I thought Mashad was going to beat beat it to that play. So we're going to bring the puck all the way back down in the Clydesdale zone. Looks like it's going to go right circle. Well, we're out shooting them 31 to 14 here, Stacy, with three minutes left yeah. in the second period. But just the scoreboard just doesn't depict no. the way this game is being played. No, nope. well, Trot comes out of it here, tries to get a pass. Boy, number 12, Alex Bruce. Oh, loose puck. Oh, Hamilton smothers it. Yeah, for a second there, Hamilton, uh, I thought he was going to lose it right to uh, uh, right to Trot, but he pulled it in at the last second. There's a faceoff right circle down in the Lakers zone. Shockley gets Gutierrez. 
Lakers come out with it, and Hamilton covers it up again. Add another shot to the old tally sheet. <laughs> Shockley against Gutierrez again, right circle. Puck goes behind the net, Lakers zone. Oh, big check by 12, Bruce. <laughs> you know, I've noticed this, Stacy. You know, whenever we play the Canadian teams, and they lay a big, and I don't care which team it is, but all the Canadian teams, when they lay a big hit on us, all you hear is a big hoop and a holler down there. <laughs> and there's, woo! <laughs> you know, but our guys are, you know, we lay some nice hits, uh, you know, all the time. <laughs> it just must be a Canadian thing. I guess so. Well, it gets the team fired up, I'm sure. <laughs> Here's a face-off neutral ice. Lakers come up with it. Spicer has it. Right circle. Tries to feed it out center. Well, that was a big swing for being that close to the net. Beeson comes out with it. Taken away by the Lakers. Here's a two on one. Feeds it over. Nice job. That bounced off. Arnold. Yep. Deep rebound. Armstrong tries to throw it up front. Gets it up there to Williams. Williams sends it down behind the net into the Lakers zone. Two minutes left in the second period. Puck thrown out front, nobody there for the Clydesdales. Now you got Blasco out there, Arnold's up there. Trant comes up with it, feeds it over to Williams. Blue line, left side. Here comes Trant, throws it up front. Ricochet, puck bouncing around. And oh, that's going to be a play. penalty. That should be a penalty. Yep, they're going to send somebody to the box. Yeah, because that never touched anything, which which should be an automatic penalty for delay a game. Yeah, I couldn't see who threw it. Uh, uh, Either it looks Lakers like they threw it. Yeah, uh, yeah, it looks like they're pointing at number four. Yep. Oh, no, is it gonna be number four or number nineteen? Let's see who they're gonna say shot it out. But we're going to go to the power play to finish out the period. You know, that last yeah. power play looked pretty good. Had a couple of real quality opportunities there moving the puck. Yep, looks like they're yeah, going to take number, number four. four. Yep, Josh Scott. He's out of Fort Francis. Yep. Doesn't look like he can hardly believe it. Apparently they don't have that rule where he's from. <laughs> no, that rule is there. Actually... Just listening to what I'm hearing here, it sounds like it actually was number 10 that shot it out. So I think I think he just can't believe that they gave it to him. <laughs> it's called being in the right place at the wrong time. I guess so. <laughs> As you can hear the door slam. <laughs> yeah. so well, we let's see if we can take advantage of it once again. Just like last period, we tied it up real late going into the locker room. Sure be nice to do the same thing here. There's Shockley against uh, Larson. Right circle down in the Lakers zone. Puck controlled by the Clydesdales. Tierce has it. The blue line sends it behind the net. Tomasoni. Morissette comes up with it. Shockley. Mashad. Tomasoni hanging out front. Lots of congestion. There's a rebound. Shockley almost gets his own. Tierce keeps it down in the zone. Throws it up there. Lakers got it. Sends it around the right side. Tierce is here for the Clydesdales. Sent over to Mashad. Left circle to Shockley. Mashad keeps it to the blue line. Oh, nice defense. By Larson for the Lakers. Oh, he giveaway. Takes, takes it away. Puck gets all the way down into the Clydesdale zone. Larson working hard. Tierce comes up with it. Let's get things rolling here. Crossing the blue line. Tierce has it near boards. More set out front. Skating through. Puck again, cleared out to neutral ice by the Lakers. Two on one. Rashad, I thought he could come for the takeaway there. Couldn't do it. 28 seconds left in the period. See if they can set it up one more time. Yeah. More set to Mashad. Shockley trying to get it. Loses it. Nice check by 13. Dallas Allaire for the Lakers. Gutierrez comes up with it. Feeds it to Allaire. Ooh. Shot wide right. Six seconds left. 
Pierce has it. Should throw one at the net. Can't do it. Boy, oh boy. I, yeah, I bet you Locker, he's not going to have very happy uh, things to be talking about in the locker room in this intermission. Nope. I mean, we definitely, we, we gave them only five shots in the period. Five shots. We had, well, we had 18, we had 15 shots to five. And yet we let them take the lead. And we had two power plays. So, and once again, they didn't step it up till the, the second half of that period. And then that last power play, it looked like they were on the power play. Yeah, they were very aggressive. Well, at the end of two periods, it's going to be a Lakers three, Clydesdales two. Clydesdales will come back with a power play for 24 seconds once the third period starts, and we'll see you then. All right.
What's the number on that last one? So 71 got a hat trick then, huh? Get him to turn us on. We'll make sure we say this at the end of the game, too. Yeah, we should say it now. We'll yeah, we will, and then we'll say it, say it the second period. Hey, Evan. Let's see if he turns us on. Hey, Evan, you want to turn us on? Thank you. All right, we're back for the third period here. Once again, I want to give a quick note. Uh, for the uh, Rachel Sandell, the love is on uh, next Sunday night here at the Heritage Center. Basically, uh, going to be a fundraiser here to raise money for coaches versus cancer. Uh, what you want to do is you want to text the word coach to 20222, and uh, if, then uh, $5 will be added to your next wireless bill, and it'll, everything like you get once again will go right to coaches versus cancer next Sunday night against Dryden here at the Heritage. And we're backing our way in the third period. Lakers lead the Clydesdales three to two. And the Lakers are back at full strength. Puck down in the Lakers zone. Now the puck sent all the way down in the Clydesdale zone. Chased down by Ryan Palm. Ryan sends all the way up to the blue line. Thomasoni gets it one on one. Right circle, tries to make a move, slips. Down he goes. Right well, so far, net. Stacey, though, this is the quickest uh, we've seen these guys jump out out of the gate here this, this entire game. So, And we're going to get offside on Spencer. Well, hopefully that'll be a good sign here. Instead of taking about five minutes to get going, they're actually going to gonna jump right on these guys right off the bat. It'd be nice to get a couple quick ones. Well, the ice looks a little quicker for some reason, too. Boy, but it's still not setting up. Here's a face-off at the center ice. Puck goes down in the Clydesdale zone. Palm chasing it down. Mashad takes it away. Frank intercepted by Trot, crossing the blue line. Left side, keeps control, tries to center it out to Mashad, intercepted by the Lakers. Sent down into the zone. Ryan Palm comes up with it for the Clydesdales. Oh! Oh, Olsen swing and a miss. Puck sent off the far boards. Shad comes up with it, sends it out front. Trot chasing it down in the Lakers zone behind the net. And the puck cleared all the way down to the other side. Arnold's going to knock it away for Palm. Pierce back out on defense for the Clyde. Well, you can tell that puck is moving slow. He had to really fire that thing to get a halfway decent pass off. There's a high pass. All the way down, Palm comes up with it. Being chased by Larson. 
Trot comes up with it behind the net, down in the Clydesdale zone, comes the near board. Boy, another miss. Boy, that Mashad, he's got a quick little stick. He's had some nifty little shots. Yeah. Got quick hands. There's Chris Palm chasing after it. Far board tries to get it up to Mashad. He has it. Line change. He's going to have to do things himself. Sends it down. Scott picks it off for the Lakers. Sends it up to the red line. Now down into the Clydesdale zone. Tierce chasing after it. Sends it back around to Blasco, who misses the puck. There's a shot from the left circle. And Arnold gloves it. Well, so far the puck's been hanging a little bit too much in our zone than I like. Yeah. So we're going to get a face-off. Looks like uh, Beeson going to go against Gutierrez. Left circle down in the Clydesdale zone. Puck controlled by Olsen. Olsen gets it up to Blaskow to Beeson. He's got Armstrong up the middle. Armstrong chases it down. Right circle. Beeson has it. Blaskow hanging out front. Knocked away by number nine. And 13, Allaire comes up with it for the Lakers. Crossing the blue line. Far boards. Left circle centers it out to 96. Knocked away by Williams. Good defense. Need to get it out of there. Armstrong chasing after it. Near boards. And out come the Clydesdales. Armstrong back to Blasco. Up the middle. Passes up to Armstrong. Left boards. Lakers zone. And taken away by Gutierrez. Kept in the zone by Beeson. Nice job by Blasco getting a stick on it, but puck comes out. McCannon chases it down, trying to clear it, getting the line. Uh oh, ran into our own guys. <laughs> That's not the guy you want to run into either. You don't want to run into Williams. He's a no. big boy. Spicer hammering it down into the Clydesdale zone. Arnold chipping it out of there for Ryan Palm. There's Tomasoni, long pass to Morset. Morset, nice move one on one. Makes a move, beautiful nice, move. Beautiful Takes play. it to the right side, throws it back left, right behind the goalie. Hamilton, yeah. that's going to tie things up 3 to 3 with 15.49 left in the third period. Well, you know, and that play started back here. Unfortunately, they. Uh, they exploited the inexperience of that, that midget age player, that Brandon Sinclair. Uh, he kind of took a step up on a play where he should have stayed back, and they fired that puck right up the middle of Morset. He was already behind him, and then he walked in all alone, put it right between the legs of Hamilton. I mean, he did exactly what he needed to do, and that was just shove it home. So, all right. I mean, now we got a game, you know, and the shots are, are definitely in our favor. Now, basically, we got a fresh game here. Yeah, it's almost two to one in favor of us. Shots on goal. Lakers trying to come back with a quick one. Nice save by Arnold. Puck down in the Clydesdale zone. Near boards in the corner. Throwing out front. Wide open shot. Oh. And give it right back. Oh, man. That wasn't even a powerful shot. It was just a little backhand flip. And he just kind of just whacked at it. Funny thing is it sat in his feet and... He made th th that little move. He just kind of just whacked at it, knocked it between his legs, spun around, and took another swat at it, and the puck was just just fluttering and right past Arnold. What uh, is going on, Stace? I tell you, right when things are looking good. Yeah, that didn't take long. Lakers back up, 4-3. A little over 15 minutes left in the third and final period. Face off, controlled by the Clydesdales. Mashad up to Trant. Trot chasing it down. Throws it over to Spencer Frank. Boy, almost had it if he get a stick on it. Mashad trying to take a shot. Oh. Got Tron out front, loses it. Pick it back up. Mashad left circle, outside the circle. Sends it around back to Franks. Tron made a great move to come in, and then it was blocked, and then Mashad just couldn't get the shot off. Puck down in the Clydesdale zone, but Palm comes up with it. Feeds it to Frank. Frank throws it across the blue line down into the zone. We're going to get a line change for the Clydesdales. I'll tell you, that line has been the, definitely the most uh, noticeable all night with opportunities. 
And, you know, and that play started too down there with a, just a, they call it a cycle, basically kind of a give-and-go pick play that, like you'd see in basketball where someone drops a puck and spins out of it, and that's what started that down there and just about created a real nice opportunity. There's Beeson against Gutierrez, left circle, face off down in the Clydesdale zone. Ryan Palm comes out of there with it, feeds it ahead. Boy, I tell you, I think we're going to see something between Chris Palm and uh, Allier here pretty quick because uh, the referee had to separate him on the face off, and then uh, he whacked Palm, come by, and then Palm gave him another shove. So I wouldn't be surprised if we see those two go at it here pretty quick. There's a shot on goal, knocked away by Hamilton. Beeson has it right out front, couldn't get a stick on it. Puck stays down in the Lakers zone. Glasgow chasing it down. Here's Armstrong, wrap around, oh. can't get it to go. Knocked away. Puck goes back out to neutralize, feeds it back to Palm. Palm over the Olsen. Loses the puck, Palm picks it back up. Sends it all the way down. And we're gonna get icing. Boy, oh boy, we just got to get one back here pretty quick, Stace. We got, the clock is ticking. Actually, this swarsky Stetton line, too, has been, has been skating real hard tonight, too. I've noticed them a couple times with some quality opportunities. Here comes Glasgow out with it, neutral ice, gives it the palm. Stolen by the Lakers, one-on-one. -on -one. Olsen with the big check. So they come up with it. There's a shot. Oh, oh how did Arnold audience. make that save? He's he no looking behind him there, was. too. And it was just laying there. Luckily, oh, nobody got Oh, boy, he just rebound. about gave that one to him, I'll tell you. Here comes Olsen, left side, crossing the blue line. Feeds it to Stetton up the middle. Knocked away by 21. There's Mashad with the turnaround shot. Just wide right. That was a nice check by Mashad. Swarski has it, gets it to Palm. That's about the third time I've seen Swarski just about snap his stick in half tonight with uh, <laughs> making a play just like that. Puck down in the Lakers zone, sent out to neutral ice. And we're going to get a whistle. Knocked down with a high stick. Wow. Well, we're still horribly out shooting him but that last play down here you know Arnold that puck laid in front of him instead of just taking it and putting it to the corner he passed it tried to pass it right up the middle of the ice and right into the Fort Francis guy and he knocked it down and walked right in just about put it in there's the puck down in the Clydesdale zone near board in the corner Shockley comes out with it he's got Tomasoni up front Got to pull up, sends it down. Shockley takes on the right side, blue line. A little arching one, wide right of the net. Oh, Morissette just hammered Morin. Boy, that is not what we needed right now. Oh, Mark Williams is going to, well, actually, they're going to give it to, uh, they're going to give it to Morissette. Yeah, he's the one that hit him. Is he? Oh, yeah. I thought it looked pretty close, though. I mean, he didn't, he just got rid of the puck. It wasn't that late. Yeah, that's the thing, you know. I mean, the puck's, the puck's got to be there. I was saying that earlier. When that puck's gone, you hit somebody, and it's going to be an interference every time. Well, so 11.58 left in the third period. Lakers up 4-3. to three. They're going to be on a two-minute power play. Face off in the right circle down in the Clydesdale zone. It's going to be Beeson against uh, Katapetek. Yeah, this is going to be an important penalty kill here. Yep. Well, first part of it, they start off right, send it all the way down to the other side. That should kill 20, 30 seconds. There they are trying to bring it up. Spicer dumps it off. Number 10, left circle. 
Nobody out front for the Lakers. 14 blue line. Now they have number 21, Kennedy, hanging out front in front of the net. And puck cleared all the way down to the Lakers zone. Looked like uh, Olsen was trying to get in front of him that time. Here's Shockley chasing after it. You never know what happens. <laughs> get a shorthanded goal. Here come the Lakers bringing it up, crossing it through the neutral zone. Here's Carlson. And there we go. Away. Here's Shockley, one on one. If right off the, the bench. If he can get it, nobody there for the follow up. Here's Mashad coming up the middle. Mashad's got it. Left circle. Sends it all the way around to Ryan Palm. Throws it towards the net. No rebound. Lakers come up with it. 30 seconds left on the power play. No shots yet. Now they're coming down. Right circle. Nice check by Olsen. Gutierrez has it. Left circle halfway in. Knocked away by Olsen. Passed over to the left side, number 11. That's Sinclair, and Clydesdale's cleared out and kill the power play. Back to full force for the Clydesdales. Well, we needed that penalty kill, that's for sure, at this point in the game. Well, we got to get one in here. be nice to get one in before the five-minute mark. Yeah, because that'll give us plenty of time to put it away. Ahead to Trant. Trant coming up the middle. He's got more set. Takes a shot. Rebound. Nobody there. Oh. And kicks it away. And Hamilton 11. was looking the other way. There's another shot. Knocked wide right. More set in there with Trant. Puck comes out. Allaire sent it over. Intercepted by the Clydesdales. Can't get it out of the zone. Stays down in there. McCannon has it. Oh, high stick. Man. Chris Palm sticked him right in the face. Oh, they're going to give him a, uh, wow, that's where give him a boarding on that. He came in with two hands up to the face with a stick, but they're going to give him a board on it. Wow. Just after we had a real nice penalty kill, didn't give him any good opportunities, and now we got to go right back to the penalty kill again. Well, 9.03 left in the third period. Face off down in the Clydesdale zone. Tomasoni going against Catapaduck. Boy, nope. Chris Palm, he's a little upset down there in the box. Hear that? Yeah, I can hear him. Puck controlled by the Lakers. Brought back out to the blue line. Far board. There's a shot from center. Ooh. Wide left. Off the backboards. Bounces back up front. Haiti has it at the blue line. Brings it back out to the middle ice. Carlson. Tipped away by Tomasoni. Carlson tries to pass it to 24. That's Colton Spencer. Far boards. Here comes Sp Spicer. Feeds it up front to Stetton. Intercepts it. We're getting a whistle for what? I didn't see anything out of the ordinary there. And uh, that's off. Yeah, near, near post is off. So. That was a quick whistle on that one, though. But we'll take that. Well, we got eight eight minutes left here. These guys better start making something happen pretty quick. Now well, we got to kill this penalty off. There's a nice job sending the puck all the way down. Minute five left in the power play for the Lakers. Lakers bringing it up, crossing center ice. Far boards into the left circle. Tierce with a nice check, slow things up a little bit. Carlson up front. Now they got intercepted by Armstrong. Let's see if he can make a move. It's one on one. Right side takes a shot. High left, knocked away by Hamilton. Lakers pass it back out, crossing the blue line, far side, left circle. 
Buchanan brings it around. Arnold tries to jump on it, loses it. Beeson comes up with it. He's got Trant there if he can get it. Trant chasing after it. 20 seconds left in this power play. Puck down in the Lakers zone. Now being brought up through center ice. Boy, Trant sure is quick. Boy, I tell you, he caught up to that puck quick. There's a pass by Morin, the 13 Alaire. Now shoves into the right corner. And back at full strength. Shockley out there. Palm back in the bench. Shot by Sinclair and Ricochet right off, uh, I think, number 13, Alaire. Boy, I think Arnold was playing a shot and some towel had ricocheted right off Alaire in the net. Actually, hold on. Nope, they're going to call no goal. Let's see what Interference? he's Interference? See what he's going to call. No goal. All right, what do we got? Uh, Yep, face off outside the zone. I think he's gonna rule. He try. He kicked it in. Oh. Yep. And on a play like that, they can't change players because. Yep, he's ruled. He kicked it into the net. So. And you know, on that play, the way that thing was deflected like that, you knew that something was up with yeah. it. Because from our angle, you called it right on. You saw it was deflected in. All right, so here's face-off neutral ice. Lakers throw it down in the Clydesdale zone. Everybody's back at full strength. Lakers still up four to three on the Clydesdale, 6.30 left in the third period. Here we go, Shockley over to Morissette. Shockley up the middle, takes a shot, high wide right. They've got everybody down there. Chris Palm on defense, Olsen the other side. Shockley oh. bringing around, right circle. Feeds it back to Olsen. He's going to take a shot from the blue line. Throws it up front. It's Ricochet. Bounces around. Just laying there. And Hamilton corrals it in. Boy, I tell you, I think we're going to see Chris Palm going at it here. Just as he, you know, once again, he was he was going at it with all the air earlier. Then he got that penalty. And now just as he came out of the box and skated by the four Francis bench, I mean, there was about three or four guys that wanted to get a piece of him. And then he's, uh, you know, yelling profanities back. So it wouldn't surprise me if we see something happen here between now and the end of the game. Well, you got to make things happen somehow. Here's uh, Trant facing off far right circle down in the Lakers zone. One against Gutierrez. Puck controlled by the Clydesdales. Thrown out front. Franks was there, but they lose it. Here's a three on two. Spicer, right circle, takes a shot. Nice save by Arnold. Also, two Here's states. This is the first period that we've had this entire game where they're out shooting us into the period. What do we got going on here now? Uh, he had kind of take, a little fight start in there between. Uh, it's going to take both of them. It's, it's going to take Trot, Trot and, and uh, Kennedy are heading to the penalty box. Boy, and that's too bad. That's one of the guys we do not want to see in the box right now because Trot has really most of our quality chances we've had this game have come off that kid's stick. There's a face-off down in the Clydesdale zone. Controlled by the Clydesdale. Stetton's got it up front. Crossing the blue line. Far side. He keeps control of the puck. Now loses it right in front of the net. Long pass up to number 24. That's Spicer. He brings it down. Crossing the blue line. Center pass. Nobody there. Palm trying to get it out of there. Frank's also working. Intercepted by Palm. Got him a shot up front if he can get it to him. Knocked away. And we're going to get an icing call. Just got a feeling Mashad's going to get one tonight. I got tell you, feeling. that whole line has been playing really, really good. Well, bringing out the big guns. We got Shockley, Morset, Tomasoni, Tierce, and Williams out there now trying to make things happen with a little over five minutes left in the third period. Clydesdale's down by a goal. Shockley gets it up the face off, throws Ooh. it high just over the goalie's head. I'd say this is the line that I think is due. They've been pretty quiet all night, and 
you know, typically when you're the number one line, they're matching you up pretty tight, and they've been pretty quiet. So I think we're going to see something here. Puck back out to neutral ice, controlled by Tomasoni, now taken away by the Lakers down in the Clydesdale zone. William, Williams comes up with it for the Clydesdales. Looking for a long pass, sends it all the way across to Morset. I don't know why he pulled up. Well, now why didn't he call that on sides? Yeah, <laughs> Here comes the Lakers, coming hard towards the net, left circle. There's a shot, and a save by Arnold. All right, well, we've got another minute yet here before uh, Trant comes out of the box. And I wouldn't be surprised when he comes out of the box if we're going to see that line out there. They don't have any time up on the clock. One. Well, because it, it's five on five, so they got two minutes and a whistle. they got to wait for a whistle. Oh. But I guarantee you that that line will be out there within the last two minutes of the game. There's Blasco to Armstrong coming through the neutral zone. Left side sends it down to near boards into the Lakers zone. Blasco chasing after it. Puck sent all the way around to the far side. Lakers control it. Pass up to Jordan. Left circle, Clydesdale zone. Picked off by Beeson. Beeson to Olsen. Olsen tries to send it down. Can't get enough stick on it. Controlled by the Lakers. Trying to set things up here. They send it down. Larson ahead. To Allaire. Intercepted by Beeson. And here he comes. Armstrong's got to pull up. Throws it towards the net. Rebound. Oh, Puck just there. there. Nobody can get a stick on it. Oh, oh. gosh. You know, Beeson didn't get a whole lot on that shot, but it just laid there, just waiting for someone to just come in and just tap it into the net. And that's nobody like, could get to it. That's like the third time tonight that the puck's just been laying there, and the goalie gets it, but he doesn't get it very quickly. It's just like very slow reaching for and I got all day time to pick it up. <laughs> Pierce, long shot from the blue line. Oh, deflected it. Man, how did Hamilton How did Hamilton, Hamilton make that it? save? Yeah, he got it. I thought that was going in the net when I saw that thing tipped. Yeah, he didn't look too sure that he had it. Yeah, how did I? I thought it might have not, out. I'm not sure exactly who tipped it, but it, it took off high quick. Here's Tront, face off, right circle, controlled by long shot from Pierce. Lakers throw it all the way down into the Clydesdale zone. That's a big check by Morin. Try to feed it up front. We almost knocked it in ourselves. Get up, Puck. Boy, lay in there. Hit it out. Chris Palm comes up with it. Throws it out to the neutral zone. Ryan Palm has it over to Tears. Puck down in the Clydesdale zone, far corner. There's a shot, knocked away by Arnold off the back wall. Tears gets a nice check in of his own. Puck comes out to the blue line, quick wrist shot up front. Another shot. Puck's not getting there, knocked <laughs> away by Palm, just kind of whacked at it. Looked like a soccer <laughs> shot. <laughs> Puck staying down in the Clydesdale zone way too long. Oh, that's not a tripping? Wow. Again, looking right at it. Here's Palm bringing it up, crossing the red line. Left side, throws it down into the zone. Only a minute 52 left. Got the number Gotta one line out there. Pretty that's... quick if they're going to do it. Lakers just content to throw it all the way down. Ryan Palm comes up with it. Nice move. Passes up to Morset. Morset coming to near side. Makes move. Left circle. He's got Tomasoni out front. Just tipped high. Tomasoni comes up with it. Well, we should be seeing Arnold come to the bench here pretty quick. Shockley sends it out to Ryan Palm. Blue line. Near side. Throws oh! it front to Morset. Got it all the way through to him, but he couldn't get it in there. 
Puck control by Shockley. Shockley coming up the middle, crosses into the left circle, feeds it out front. Nobody there. Here's Ryan Palm shot and saved by Hamilton. Boy, I think if he could have moved it a foot right, it would have went in. Yeah. The right side got, is open. Unfortunately, got a little too much turf on that when he uh, when he whacked at it. Yep. I tell you, he really didn't get a, a quality shot off with it. And uh, it didn't get in there, I'm sure, not nearly as hard as he wanted it to. But what did I tell you, though? Oh, oh they're throwing Ryan Palm in the box. Yeah, that's going to be offset. He'll be five on five. So I'm sure that we're going to see Locker take his time out here. And uh, I'll bet you for this last minute here, we're going to see. We're going to see Trant. We're going to see Mashad. We're going to see all the guns here. With a face-off in the Fort Francis zone, he's going to bring Arnold to the bench. Yep. Okay. Well. Well, we got a second. Let's go over that once again. Coming up next Sunday, um, it's going to be the night for memory of Rachel. Sandell. Uh, she was an East student who died of cancer this October, I believe. Yep, about a month ago. And so they're calling it the Love is On for Rachel Sandell. Basically, they're uh, dedicating the whole night here next Sunday night against Dryden to Rachel Sandell. And uh, all the proceeds are going to be going to a good cause for Coaches for Cancer. So they're trying to get as many folks out here to the rink as they can. So, so please, if you can't, come on out. And uh, once again, you know, a good chunk of the money that's going to be raised next uh, of the basically the gate receipts and other things is going to be going right to the coaches oh, for cancer. Three dollars from every ticket sold is going to be going towards that. Plus, if you want to start giving now already, you can text coach to two zero two two two, and five dollars will be added to your next wireless bill. With a hundred percent of those proceeds going to the American Cancer Society in honor of Rachel Sandell. Once again, next Sunday, the love is on here at the Heritage. Well, a little less than a minute left. Empty net for the Clydesdales. Here's Shockley bringing it up. Wow, I am I am really shocked. And maybe it's just me. I'm really shocked to see Williams out there. Why is it just me? Why isn't Trant out there? Yeah, you would think so. So face off right circle, Shockley, 37.9 seconds left. Clydesdale's down one, there's a shot! Oh! Wide left by Morset. Olsen throws it up front to Shockley right through his stick, it looked like. Puck kept down in the zone. Oh, can't uh, hold it in. Now they gotta clear it. Controlled by the Clydesdales. Puck brought back out to neutralize Olsen. I'm surprised he's out there too. Puck down behind the net, down in the Lakers zone. Somebody's got to throw it out front, can't do it. We're going to get a whistle. We got fighting out front. Got Williams going at it. Oh, third man in there, too. Yeah. Definitely third man in. I mean, he came and he came and hit Williams from behind, number 10. If he doesn't get a third man in on that, I mean, it definitely gave the Fort Francis player the, uh, yeah, that the was, upper uh, hand. That was number 10, Byron Katapetuk. <laughs> yeah, Katapetuk. Yeah, I didn't see anybody even uh, raise their hand when that was in there. Yeah, I mean, Williams, Williams had control of the situation pretty good. Number 10 came in and cross-checked him right in the back of the head. And then just jumped right out. Well, 3.5 seconds left. Boy, you're going to have to pretty much get something right off the face off here. Yeah. Well, 
Well, th- yep, and they did. They did give. They did give uh, number ten a five-minute major for a high stick, right. which he should have. I mean, so that he, was that was totally uncalled for he when he came in. Two and, games then, correct? Well, if they didn't give a third man in for a fighting, if they only gave him a five minute for a high stick. But what good does that do you? There's only three seconds left in the game. It's it's just over or something? All it does is nope, just goes on the stat sheet. Uh, Unfortunately, he's a, my son did that once where I he got a, a checking a five minute major checking from behind with a ten minute misconduct. With like two seconds left, so he got 15 minutes of penalty, and he only had to serve two seconds. It should carry over until the next time they play. Why wouldn't you do it that way? Uh, it doesn't work that way. Why not? I'll uh, I'll give you the email address of the league commissioner. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what are they jawing about down there? Well, we're going to get Gutierrez for the Lakers facing off against Shockley, right circle. Well, I can guarantee you this. Every white jersey you see is going to be going right at Hamilton. You know what's amazing to me? Is we are still not seeing Trant out there. Shot, had it out front. Couldn't you know what was amazing? They actually got a shot to the net too, which oh, was yeah, great. I got mean, a nice quick little wrist shot, but yeah, you know, what a heartbreaker tonight, though, Stacy. I yeah, mean, they played well to get, enough to win, I think. You know, they played they played good enough to win. I mean, 43 shots on goal, and actually a lot of quality quality shots tonight. You know, several odd man breaks where they either just couldn't connect or just shot it wide and. You know, the break, you know, different key things, that breakaway by Blasco, you know, just a bunch of little stuff, but they played good enough to win, and, you know, unfortunately, sometimes that's just the way it goes. Well, that's uh, going to do it for tonight. Clydesdale's drop two out of three this weekend. Final score tonight, Lakers four, Clydesdale's three. We'll see you next time from the Heritage. <laughs>